On Friday, September 28th, the 2-1 Hopkinton Hillers hosted the 3-0 Ashland Clockers. The Clockers haven't won at Hopkinton since 2007 and were looking to change that and stay undefeated on the season. It was a defensive battle throughout much of the game, but in the second quarter, Ryan Kelleher found Brandon Kelly. Sets, he's got somebody wide open. Is that Brendan Kelly? I mean, wide open down the middle, Don. I don't know whose responsibility that was, but that was a blown coverage. Touchdown Hillers, and the extra point made it 7 to nothing. The only other score came late in the fourth quarter. The Ashland Clockers found some momentum and drove downfield. First down at the 15 yard line, thereabouts. 156 to go in the fourth. Davenport back, back, he throws deep into the end zone, into coverage, caught! Dom Cavanaugh finds Kevin Russell, a 15-yard touchdown, and now for the extra point to tie it. Right? Yeah, uh, whoever, whoever, whoever wins, this, I mean, whoever wins this got the inside track, right? Well, you still got another team there that plays next to us. It should have something to say about it. Block! It's, so oh, oh no, fake. it's fake! Oh, it's fake! And the two-point conversion is good! It's a perfectly executed fake. Nathan Sickles, the holder, finds Abib Ahmed, and it's 8-7 Ashland. Hillers still have time left. Could they take advantage of it? And he's got to just throw it underneath. Another one, another one of these, and Deloy has got it now. And the big lineman got it, but he doesn't know what to do with it, and he just kind of throws it up, and it's over. The clock is a well-earned victory and some gutsy calls by Coach McKay. The Ashland Clockers hold on and take the game by a final of 8-7. Ashland improved to 4-0. Hopkinton falls to 2-2. What a finish to this 95-year-old TVL rivalry. Truly unbelievable. Tough loss for the Hillers, but the Clockers certainly deserve some credit for this one but it was an amazing defensive battle by both teams. Before the football game on Friday, Hopkinton Hillers girls volleyball took on Holliston for the top spot in the TVL. The Hillers girls came out of the gate firing on all cylinders. Hopkinton took the first set 25 to nine. They continued the domination in the second set and took it 25 to 11 and then took set number three, 25 to 14, to improve their record to eight and one. It was the Hillers' seventh sweep of the season. Hopkinton has an eight and O league record and finds themselves at the top of the TVL. Hopkinton just two wins away from clinching a playoff spot.